A Fort Bliss soldier is getting a custom truck. Work is going to start on a custom truck today after his last one was stolen just days after he purchased it. KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap is live in the newsroom with his story and what he'll soon get from the community. U.S. Army Corporal James Wesley Trent's truck was stolen last year when he was on leave in Florida. But today, a Florida truck part company and a local El Paso shop are coming together to recreate the truck of his dreams. Fort Bliss U.S. Army Corporal James Wesley Trent had saved up to get the truck he always wanted, a gold F-250. I just spent time in the Middle East and saved a bunch of money to be able to buy the truck. Back in August, he came home to visit family in Florida. During that time, he was finally able to purchase that truck, and he had planned to drive it back to El Paso, but he only had it a few days when it was stolen, stripped, and burned to the ground. I don't know why someone would do that. I think it's just greed. People want what other people have. Tough Truck Parts, based in Florida, heard about what happened to the corporal's original truck and raised $20,000 in order to customize his new one. The Army Corporal now has a silver F-250 that the company will be lifting, adding a new bumper and alarm system, along with other additions. All the parts that will be used were also donated. We really respect the U.S. military and, you know, everybody that protects our freedom. So we, uh, we absolutely had to do something for this young man. Local El Paso truck shop, Four Wheel Parts, will be adding all of the custom parts to the corporal's new truck starting today. They say it will take about a month to finish everything, and Corporal Trent says it means the world to him. Definitely, uh, definitely helps me restore a little trust in the community. To wait much longer to get his custom dream truck because today four wheel parts will start adding all the custom parts to his truck. And Corporal James Wesley Trent says that he cannot thank them enough. Reporting live from the newsroom, Shelby Cap, KTSM 9 News. Well, that is an awesome story. I love, love hearing yeah. stories like that. So